Good day everybody. Welcome back to the High Desert Garden. Now if you are from this area of Central Oregon, you know that we still get really cold nights and we can get frost all the way up into mid-July. I think that's about when our last frost date is. And you might be thinking, I planted my peppers in the raised bed way too early. And I'll tell you, last night we got down to about 31 degrees. And uh, I was worried about the peppers because they should definitely not be in the ground, or at least without protection at this time. Uh, I did have them in the greenhouse. The tomatoes were just getting too big. The pepper plants were big and I couldn't have them in the greenhouse anymore. So uh, I didn't have much choice other than to plant them out. Uh, I generally do plant them out around this time every year. It is risky, but if you're careful, you can get away with it. Um, the peppers do take a, a slight uh, hit, maybe some stunted growth. Uh, they typically don't go into any sort of a shock, at least not for too long. Um, and when we get really cold nights like we did last night, uh, you definitely got to cover them up. So uh, the forecast said the overnight low was going to be 35. And with that forecast, I definitely should have covered them up before going to bed. This time of year, I'm exhausted from working. I didn't cover the peppers before going to bed. But I happened to awaken around 2 a.m., and I felt kind of cold, so I checked the, the temperature outside, and it was 33, still on its way down. So I came outside, I covered the peppers, and we're going to take a look and see how they did. Okay, so here they are. And they definitely look decent for dealing with some cold nights and uh, recently being transplanted so you can see the habanero plant here still growing strong we got some habaneros on there this was a five gallon bucket of it, water out of the tap as hot as you can get it i did that at 2 a.m because it was just way too cold for these peppers so i filled that up with super hot tap water i threw my plastic over the top of these peppers here's my plastic over here because I might end up needing it again tonight forecast says a low of 36 but you can't count on that around here in the high desert it could easily get down to 30 degrees it's not uncommon for them to be 6 to 10 degrees off on their predictions so um, that's it they're doing still really really well and it won't be but another week or two that we really shouldn't have extreme cold nights like this we can get uh still possibly get some frost like i said up until uh early mid july but uh if we get cold snaps like that it, they really should it should not stay uh cold for very long the the, the coldness is a very quick uh, cold snap this time of year so typically plants that are this mature can handle a quick cold snap like that as long as it don't stay cold for too long so that's what i, I got uh, i wanted to let you guys know that uh, even with the cold snap last night things are still okay here so hopefully if you're from around here or somewhere cold as it is here um, hopefully you've still got your plants under cover or that uh, you're protecting them and you're you're watching the forecast uh, thanks so much for supporting the channel and watching this video I want to encourage you guys to grow organic so you can eat organic and so you can be organic <laughs>